So Google, <clears throat> thank you for having an endless supply of images that we can just borrow for the time being. All right, uh, how about swirling clock? I don't know. Images. Okay, so this one's kind of interesting. I'm just gonna click on this and I'm gonna click view image and I'm going to save this. So on a Mac, I just drag the images onto my desktop. Um, you might need to like right click and save it into your drive or onto your desktop or however you need to save it. <clears throat> I think on the Chromebook, if you use two fingers and double click, it should save it onto your Chromebook as well. Okay, so I have my clock image over there. I'm going to go back to Pixlr, and I'm going to open this in Pixlr now. So I'm going to click File. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, open image and here it is on my desktop I'm gonna click on that and click open okay so I have two different images open right now I have this one and this one and I want to get this clock into this image so how do we do that first make sure you're on the clock image or whichever image that you're putting onto your project. I'm going to go up here to edit. I'm going to click select all and you're going to see the dancing ants going around your whole image. Okay. You're going to go back to edit and you're going to click copy. Now you're going to click on your project page, this one. Go back to edit and you're going to click paste and it's gonna paste the image right in the middle of your picture. So obviously we don't wanna leave it like this. Um, you know, we can move this around or do something to it. Um, I don't really like all this white extra space here. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is get rid of that. <clears throat> to get rid of the white space and just have the black lines and the black numbers, you could click on this right here it's a magic wand tool. Click in the white. Okay, you see all the dancing ants. And now I'm going to click delete on my keyboard and it's going to get rid of most of the white. It didn't get rid of everything. So now I need to kind of go back in and get rid of these big spaces kind of one at a time, which is annoying, but you can do it. Okay, so remember that uh, navigator tool where you zoom in? Now would be a good time to use that. So I'm going to zoom all the way in. This way I can fix this. Okay, so let me zoom out. Let me just get rid of that. Whoops. All right, so I didn't mean to select that, so I'm going to go back and I'm going to go to Edit, Undo. All right, so how do we get rid of the dancing ants once we're finished? All right. So you're going to go to edit 
and deselect all and it will stop. I'm going to go to my move tool and I'm going to figure out where I want to actually move this. Whoop. And look at that. I still have um I still have this white box here which I need to get rid of. So, I'm going to fix that. I'm going to go back to my magic wand tool and get rid of this. Click delete. Edit. <clears throat> Deselect all and it's gone. 